So when you click on the link, it should take you to Teams and ask you to log in. If it does not take you to Teams, you can just go to the general page, click on division with six and seven, and it will load from there, okay? The link that I have in here in the, in the PowerPoint is just to take you to Teams so that you don't have to come out of it to go find it. But if it doesn't work, then you can go directly to General to get the link. Okay, so you've already opened your link and you're ready to begin. This is what you're going to see. Your instructions are over here. It says draw to complete, show all steps, take your time and try your best. And I have the Division Family poem right there for you. And for the purpose of this video, I have an example here. You will not get the same number to work out. You will be using dividing by six and dividing by seven. You will only have two to do, okay? Just want you to practice two dividing with numbers that are a little bit bigger. So there are two options to put in your answer. I will confer say that divides, which is the divisor five divided by four. I can either go ahead and put my number five cannot go into four. So my answer will be zero. I could either draw it in like that, or I could come here and let me erase it so I can show you. Or I could come down here where it asked me to draw and I can choose text. And I can go ahead and click there and I could put in my answer, which is zero. Okay, and then I could say, mom multiplies. Okay, let me put back the zero. Then I could say, mom multiplies zero times five is zero. I could come here and I could put my zero. And then sister subtracts. So you can also use the text if you would like to. Um, but to me, it would be easier if you just go ahead and use the drawing right, so that you can get used to it a little bit. So I'm going to erase the text and I'm going to be using the drawing tool to put in my answer. So follow along with me as we go over long division. Step one, dad divides. This is dad and he's going to divide into this number. Five into four is zero because five cannot go into four. Four is too small. Second step, mom multiplies. I'm going to take that zero and I'm going to multiply it by the five, the divisor. Mom multiplies zero times five is zero. Third step, sister subtracts. This means it's time for me to subtract. We'll go ahead and draw my little line and I'm going to subtract four, take away zero. It's like I'm saying four, take away nothing. It will still be four, okay? And then brother brings down. I'm gonna bring down the next number in line. Gonna bring down the number right here, right beside the four, the number in the tenth place, right? And then my step says Rover repeats, which means I'm gonna start all the way back from the top. Dad divides, that is the divisor here, and it's gonna be divided into this new number, 49. So I want to see how many times can 5 go into 49. And I have my timetable here so that I can show you how to find that. So I'm going to go ahead and look at the 5 times table and I'm going to look over the side where the answers are to see the closest number to 49 is 45. I can't use 50 because that's too big. So 45 is the closest number which means my answer is 9. So 9 can go into... 9 can go into, 5 can go into 49, 9 times, okay? Now I need to continue, mom multiplies. Mom multiplies the single number, the single number here, 9 times 5. 9 times 5 is 45, so I will write my 45, line it up by the house. Tens under tens, hundreds under hundreds. It's important that we line it up. Some people are not lining up and then you're not getting it right. So now my third step says sister subtract. So I'm gonna go ahead and subtract. I start over at the tens house, the number here, okay? So nine take away five is four. And number is the same, zero is the game. So I just subtract. 
Next step, brother brings down. Now I have to bring down the number two, the next number nine, all the way down to this line. And after brother brings down, Rover repeats. I'm gonna repeat the steps again. Okay, I have to repeat the step again and it will become dad divide. Dad, this is dad divides into the new number that I have found here. 5 into 42. How many times can 5 go into 42? Well, let's take a look. The closest number to 42 is 40. I can't use 45 because that's too big. So 40, so my answer is 8. So I will say 5 can go into 42 8 times, and I'll put my 8 on top of the 2. Line up your numbers in line, right? So next step says mom multiplies. I'm going to multiply the 8 times 5. 8 times 5 is 40. I will put my 40 here under the new number that I'm working with. Some people are bringing their answers here and then it's not correct. Line it up with the new number you're working with. 1s and 10s. My next step says sister subtract. I'm going to go ahead and subtract. 2 take away 0 is 2. Number is the same, zero is the game. And then it says brother brings down. There's no other brother to bring down. And I don't need to repeat because there's no other number to divide it by. So this becomes my remainder, right? So this is my remainder. So my answer is 98 remainder two. So 492 can be divided by five, 98 times, and there's going to be two remainders. So go ahead and complete the ones that I have for you after you click the link. But don't forget, when you are finished, the important thing that people forget is to send it. Click on the envelope here and then press send. So it will ask you to send your answer. Your name will already be there. You just need to press send and that way I can get it. Okay? Bye.